Dagas CFM, Sanbonani, it's yet another Monday, and we are wrapping up Men's Health Month in a very special way. Uh, today I'm very excited, I'm very uh, scared at the same time, so I'm going to have a conversation with you. Joined by two exciting and very relevant people in the space of health. Uh, by, I think, furthest to my right is Dogotela Osabelo Kumede, who is a psychologist, uh, not new to Gaga CFM and not new to, probably new to Elevate. And yeah. uh, he's been a friend of Kaga CFM for 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 Miyagi Mningi, and also a doctor Shabalala. I want to be Mningi, but Mazige, Mr. Mr. Trazala, please don't talk. Beno Alex on Thursdays on Sex in Dab. He is a a a a general practitioner, a doctor, and a sex expert, sex health expert rather. So joining me, Namtlange, uh, Angalengawe, Pagatwayo. Welcome to Elevate. Come back again. No, sir, Phila, sir, Phila, and Bamo, thank you for uh, having us. Uh, we, we really appreciate this opportunity and we're looking forward to share some information. Mm. Uh, <laughs> Yeah. And I think one of our weekly uh, family members, La Station, Dr. Lushabalala, Amakalela, Asazi, Waka Kulu, Yang Bon, among the Alabag YouTube, you should say, We are Kaza, we are part of Cucumber, it's Manju Cucumber, Funan, Kotag, it's a true man, it's a true, it's a man, but it's a baby boy. But I'm so much any king as well. Kata, that's in Jan, Oglungi, Saiki, Mogosumuntu, you know, I've been in Pilemon. You know, it's got cool guys as well because we go through a lot. You know, just like we babu kumeti da ituze wam, because it you know we'll share some information and we hope with the information that we're gonna share, yeah. you know, it's gonna bring light not only to men but to the society in general, mm. because we don't live you know alone as men. Talking about shedding light to the general public and society at large, Men's Health Month is something that has been, I think, highlighted for the past few years. Since 1994. Mm. Since 1994, we started, you know, generating and creating programs as a country that are going to cater, you know, to men. Mm. Because we saw that if, you know, we close off men and we don't include them, it's going to be a bit of a challenge later on. And it's happening even now. Hence why now people are benchmarking and they're trying to create awareness around men's health. But it's not a new concept. Yeah. The concept of sexual health is a bit you know, new, it's a bit modern. Whereas men's health, it's not new. Because sexual health is inclusive. Yeah. You know, it's inclusive of females as well. Yeah. Like I said, if you don't know what you're talking about, you don't know what you're talking about. You don't So it's kind of thing. All we know is abantu, you know, banoblili, obungafani, abanya banoblili, obfanai. So when it comes to sexual health, we have to look at that aspect as well. You know, so we're creating awareness of everything that is happening currently, which is brought on by what we call the modern society, the modern way of living nowadays. Yeah. Kumete, over the past couple of years, and I think it, the issue has been exacerbated by COVID, lockdowns, Lizemakaya, our mental health, health situation has skyrocketed. Ngendela is smang. What is your take? And I think you, you do and work with quite a few people at Cloud Therapist as well. What's your general assessment of the world we are living in today? Well, uh, you know, thank you. Um, I think we share as I think one of the uh, difficulties that we as a country uh, are struggling with uh, is that we have got nice policies, we have got nice documents uh, when it comes to you know overall aspect of everything. You know, it's the same thing when it comes to health, when it comes to mental health. We've got nice policies. Um, yeah, currently, we have got uh, something that is called Vision. Uh, 2020, uh, 2030 for mental health, uh, Department of Health. But in terms of, you know, taking steps and actually making sure that whatever that is being written in the policy is being executed, it becomes, you know, an, 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 an issue, you, mm. you understand? So we have a challenge of the lack of awareness, education and intervention when it comes to mental health in South Africa. You have um, a situation where, you know, you have men that are refusing to come and see psychologists or even come and talk about general health issues. You know, we were just having um, a council, uh, 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 um, you know, uh, uh, a meeting uh, or conference at ICC on AIDS. Uh, I think it was um, 
taking place for the previous uh, three days, actually. Uh, I think it was concluded, yeah, yeah, yesterday. But uh, if you look at the statistics of the people that are actually, um, you know, being just struggling with, uh, uh, you know, accessing uh, uh, HIV uh, medication, it's men. And it tells you that we still have a lot of way to go when it comes to um, getting men into where they are and pushing them <laughs> to actually go and access help. Now, it's the same thing when it comes to mental health. There's a, a lot of stigma. Mm. Um, there is a lot of, uh, you know, cultural uh, uh, norms uh, that uh, actually are related to what we call toxic masculinity, masculinity mm. um, where, you know, men are being told that, uh, you know, you don't have to talk to someone about your issues. Uh, you don't have to share your issues in the bazako, as a in the bazako, you know, the same day in Ezako, it must end there. You know, and the society is demanding, and, 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 the, and the law of life is demanding something else. You still have to go there and deal with pressure and all of that. That's why we see a lot of suicide. Uh, we see a lot of people actually struggling, and you know, and, and you find them behaving in the ways that you say, what is going on there? You find that people are struggling, but they're not actually, you know, coming forward for help. So those are the issues that we are, that we still find ourselves in 2023. You know, where we talk of mental health and we talk of, you know, July as, 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 as actually, you know, as mental health month, but no one actually, you know, is actually, you know, giving you, you know, prevalent statistics to say, this is the intake yeah. uh, of mental health in terms of intervention. And also this is uh, the intake in terms of awareness. And also this is intake in terms of education across the spectrum. You go to school, there's nothing. You go to a hospital, uh, you know, there is, there is one psychologist responsible to see the whole population wow. of, 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 the of, hospital. Of, of the hospital. So wow. those are the issues that we are struggling uh, with. But yes, Baba, <clears throat> another thing that we, we have to, you know, put forward. Yeah. Um, as, as much as, as we, we can, can create all these platforms, uh, let us not run away from you know, the point of education. He's touching on a very important point. Mm -hmm. When it comes to education, it increases even awareness. Now, Lendo Yoguti, Amadota Awakali, Afela Ngapagat, even me, na Ingwiti Amle, Ebtenin, and Funugui Kaeta Leon, as a sexual health specialist in Funugui Kaeta, because Yazu Bale Latina is a Banbes Lisa. We need to be able you know, to utilize our platforms that are being offered to us so that we can create you know a platform where we can engage even as men in terms of uguti seeing obagan jani ginkinga as ama daughter because you might find which is a conference someone will speak up you know and say which i've gone through this i've gone through this but here i am now in life and this is what i did for me to get here and and they are facing the very same problem so, say say I told her, solution, we talk work seven zela when we good. Now me again, go back now when king again zame good. It's not only about putting education out there, but it's also about implementing, you know, things that are gonna come with change. Cause we can sit the whole day, we can talk, but we also have to have good implementers. You know, the implementation system has to be very good. I often say conversations can start and end a war. Yes. How much? <laughs> Do, does the lack of conversing around the Banbis Lisa in your take? But the conversations that we are having, are they conversations that are helping us? Okay. So I usually say, it doesn't matter whether you are a female or, or male. Okay. Yeah. So now, if Uibuga is Umundu, you have to make a decision which is about mundo ganjan, which is about billions and almost about mag. So, ubalegi lelo ko ugoti squares guakana ma societies. Societies na ma communities are built on families, you know. So, if sngabuyele ma siswein, you know, our traditional values as black people, we have completely lost them, merely because of modern feminism. I'm not an anti-feminist. I yeah. totally understand feminism. But there are people who have absolutely no clue what feminism has done to us as a society. Hence now, I usually ask men, stand up. Because sihleli, and allowing things to go further and further in terms of being detrimental to our own society as black people. So mele sume as men, mobo uksuma wedu, guzo gwenza ugu tisibuyele beke masiswene, ektenini, vele pele, ngogwen tosoka jehova, ngogdala ga jehova. 
umuntu wesilisa kahle kahle vele inhloko everywhere la uhamba khona ezimuntu wesilisa kumele ube inhloko inhloko yempilo yakho ne inhloko zempilo zawo wonke umuntu ozomfaka under impilo yakho and i think so, publicly the, 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 there's a there's a hierarchy it's god man and then the family exactly. so the, the the god we have in our lives translates the the, the 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 spectrum of life that we need to live to the man and he now translates it to the entire family let's not you know shy away from coughing up and saying that we are affected as a society merely because of everything that is happening around us. Everything is changing. The world is moving in a different direction now. So what can we do you know, to still instill those values in terms of not causing you know, confusion within even yeah. our own families? Without bashing anyone or any movement, the, the, the empowering of women I think it has been left unchecked for a very long time. It has. It has because we started with feminism. Yeah. Now we have modern feminism. So it definitely has. A lot of things we tend to you know, ignore when it comes to politics, when it comes to law and all of that. But if you look at the situation in South Africa in general, mm. a lot of things tend to favor now you know, women. Yeah. A lot. You know, our law system, system favors women. women. Yeah. Our quota system favors women. You know, this is so detrimental. Because I'm a stats now, but we also have to apply the stats. Yeah. At my universities, we are seeing a drop in applicants, male applicants. Wow. We are seeing a huge drop, and it's creating a problem for us. Hmm. A very big problem. Because now it's changing even the workspace. It's changing so even something that we call... We tr we're trying by all means to prevent that. Yeah. But then again, we need awareness first. We need to spread what modern feminism is doing to our society. And what do you think needs to be done now for, for the counterparts, the males? The males. Egmele, do, do we need empowerment seminars? Do we need, what do we need? To enjoy it, it's a but lama band la kona njanga manje, akulu mizindo, ntasim bezengaki. We need leaders that are not going to damage, you know, us. We need leaders that are going to have leadership characteristics. And we need honest people. Because in our days, people are scared to even be honest. The first thing I said when I joined Ikaka's FM family, yeah. I said, Nina, ginletela And I will never deviate from the truth. Because the truth is the truth. Mm. And everything around us is built on truth. Yeah. But we are trying to shy away from that. And we are trying to accept you know, something that is not a norm. Mm. <laughs> Actually, I want to build on what you are saying uh, when you say Injobo Itungela Ebandla, Okula Matota Gyabigo. Look at that and look at the contradiction uh, of what is happening from uh, what I was saying earlier when it comes to mental health intake and, uh, you know, health intake, uh, sexual education intake and all of that. Sitisinangesintu, uh, Right? So she was mounting king. A clue Mount age or twelve. Would he lay la clue la lil? Gumel would to hamble jealous someone. But we don't do that. We rather go and gossip with friends or talk to people that are actually would like to actually would like to amplify, are likely to amplify our problem and not go to the expert when it comes to the problem that you are struggling with. So I also see a very big contradiction there from what our culture stands for and what our culture preaches and what we do as an action, you know, in solving our problems. Are there any actions, Gumeto or Abonayo? I'll plainly put them. The substance abuse that yeah. we're seeing in the, in the society, yeah. uh, the woman abuse, yeah. and all kinds of things that are deficient in our society as men. Lizzo Zindu, do you perhaps see them as an expression of the turmoil? Definitely. So, 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 someone was asking me, how does trauma happen? What is the psychological, the science behind the happening of, of trauma? So, I was trying to explain it to say, Right, so it, it it is always running, trying to tr trying to find solutions. Right, so if you are confronted with a problem or a challenge that needs immediate solution, mm. for example, you get you are being uh, you've been uh, 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 sexually ass assaulted, 
or you, uh, you have been um, uh, hijacked, right? So that's a trauma that has happened to you. And there's actually a, a huge uh, uh, blood circulation in your body really trying to resolve that problem, right? In actually coming up with a clear mind state or solving or being a, a well uh, a being and ultimately a thriving person. Yeah. Now, when this trauma happens, it goes to the body and then the body, as you can see when you look into a computer, that thing that, that is actually rounding like that, yeah. yes. The mind does that, trying to solve the problem, right? So it keeps doing that, buffering, 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 trying to solve a problem. And when it does not reach a solution or when you don't go and seek help, to a mental health specialist, to a whoever that can help you, it keeps doing that. Mm. And when it's doing that, increase, ultimately increases the blood pressure in your, in your body, yeah. the blood circulation in, at, 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 at a level that is able to accept. And ultimately, when it does that, increase the, the, the blood uh, circulation at a high pace, and then it can ultimately create a, 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 a blood clot right and ultimately it leads to a stroke now you see wow. the problem from a psychological problem to a healthy physical problem that is created because someone was unable to actually go and get help so that is the science of actually you know um, mental health difficulties mental health trauma ultimately leading to physical health problem so is it, is, is it possible uh, for, for the same to happen in, 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 the, in the same order but reverse? From, let, let, let's say I'm having erectile dysfunction yeah. or can that now lead me, if I don't take care of it, to a mental health issue where it I'm now definitely, depressed? Definitely, definitely does. Now, if we look at what we call sexual dysfunction, right, there are two leading in men. Sexual dysfunction are equally limited to males only. Mm. You know, you, you do get sexual dysfunction <laughs> even in females. No, serious. <laughs> we do, we do. There's something about legal in my females. You know, you bezog to atrophic vaginitis. Ibalegile leo condition leo merely because it's the dryness of the vagina during sexual intercourse. Ekunisi cause a pain during sex. Besintomba zani kunenga saifuni pain. And leo into iya ikuna saifuni sex because of pain. Leo into ikuna si affect psychology. Yomuto spazani. Nagumuto slisa ya definitely. There are two ahamba pamu. Pelaska sa izo le na tinam tina sa zote ni iti 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 pele ba mbisi 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 we have something called erectile dysfunction, and then we have something called premature ejaculation. Mm -hmm. So erectile dysfunction, uguti nduga isa green, nduga isa vug. No manga tui ya vuga, ayi wenzu msebe nzu mokpelele, ikatala no manga tui nga pagat. Besa kwa kwa na leg tui ayi premature ejaculation. Premature ejaculation, usugu sufiga eli guvutonda ab. You don't even last a minute sometimes. Abanya baya figa bakale mwuti, abangeni nishunge na pagat kumundu asifazane, and then sebe kamil. Now let us look at this in this way. So from a standpoint, so much was Lisa on a premature ejaculation. Uzo bane form of embarrassment. Form of embarrassment, yes, Lisa, even in confidence. Yes, Lisa, even in ego. Tina, as a man, best Lisa, we thrive on ego. Yeah. Si shukile guna ban wesfazan. We thrive on status. Si shukile guna ban wesfazan. That's another thing. Ebalegi le angzo kuzele la gui point diga babu kumet. Yeah. Kumele si understandan u si shukile. Umuntu wa sifazane, na umuntu wa slisa, si shuki. Aba fani stand. Biology dictates that. It's not ingondo yo mundu. It's biology that dictates that. Because when we look at sex, ngoba skuluma vele nge men's health, na mtlandia skuluma nge sexual health. If you look at sex, there are only two types. Because if I ask you with what is sex, sex, the definition of sex is gender. By books, by everything that we've known before, there's only two, XY and XX. And then you have variations, okay? But there's XY and XX. So XY is for males, XX is for females. Yeah. So the conditions that usually affect males, they end up affecting you even if you don't practice being a male. Sure. They will end up affecting you because your genes are XY. You have a prostate, <laughs> you have a prostate. Yeah. A female doesn't have a prostate. A female has a womb, a male doesn't have a womb. 
So even if you say, no, I'm not going to practice being a maid, you are still so at even risk. Your, your orientation is, it, exactly, is otherwise. Exactly. Yeah. So sexual, you know, anxiety, sexual disappointments, sexual embarrassment, it does end up leading to psychological issues. And what <laughs> majority of the time with us males, it leads to only one thing, anger. Yeah. Anger. Yeah. And anger is the drive, the drive for GBV. Yeah. Anger. Now, so are you saying now, if, if we can sing a few ugly ngigiti and up, fix this, nip it in the bud, we can see a decline, uh, this isn't me now wishing, a decline in GBV cases? We can, as long as we can make females understand that we as males and make males understand we only have one hormone that governs it's the testosterone. But I'm a females, they have four hormones that govern intellectual biological clock in There are four ama hormones. So of course umuntu wesifazane will have fluctuation in moods more than umuntu wesilisa khamba because they interchanging within exactly. these four. Now it has testosterone nayo ifika nokudoda. And ubudoda bufika ne authority, ubudoda bufika ne ego, ubudoda bufika ne self esteem ethanda ukuba higher, you know, ubudoda. So ziningi izinto ekumele si understand. We can't just leave it at ukuthi no umuntu wesifazane umuntu wesilisa no understand how do I operate? as umuntu wesifazane so that you can prevent ama issues like ingxabano later on emshadweni mm. ngoba abantu wesifazane babuye babe nkinga bazama ukushintsha bazama ukusikondishina you can't tame me and say you want me to be feminine yo as umuntu wesifazane but be, be in touch with your feminine side but to be in touch with your feminine <laughs> side but here comes the problem uyithintilo babugumayate psychologically here comes the problem they say we must talk they say no if you have a problem tell me if you have an issue with me doing something, tell me. And then you open up and you tell them, I don't like this, I don't like that. And they immediately become defensive and they become closed off. And now we don't have a platform to further, you know, say, Because mm. my sense of umlimaza dumutenai. Jalo mangitinya zamukuluma uvelangene in this defensive mode. And perhaps you were, re you were just being honest. And, and, you were just and, being honest. And, and voicing men, out. Ushilo watas kulum. Yeah. As vamsi luba. Yabo. Nini, and it takes eti, a lot for a man to, to sit down and say, Sala pants now, mama, it's I, mama, gonna So, if they can understand that as females and we can, you know, work together within a relationship, whether it's a committed relationship or not, but if we can work together on that, there are a lot of issues that can be improved. Well, thank you so much, gentlemen. Uh, it's, 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 it's very insightful. Uh, it's <laughs> 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 I think these are conversations that we need to have on a much more regular basis. Yes, I do know. <laughs> But it is an engaging conversation that you at Nabanya ever eating at. You will find that you will call in Kuluma for the Munisic DM and say that you are just a young shepherd. The Nilo Bishop of Buffett, you call the I Konukulumin, a Kunin. So, and we do have people, Abafana and I, who met Nine Shabalala, who are here to help you guys. So, make sure that you find us and find them online. I'm going to allow them an opportunity to share with Matolagala Gabi as cloud therapist. And I do know Dr. Shabalala has opened a brand new. Uh, yes, uh, no. Thank you so much for having us. We really appreciate it. Uh, like you said, my name is Sabelo Kumed. I'm from Cloud Therapist. We are situated here in Deben, Greyville. Mm -hmm. uh, so we provide comprehensive mental health from screening to the intervention. And Cloud Therapist, you know, you offer. Yeah, so cloud therapy, so we offer mental health digitally, yeah. uh, but we also uh, uh, accept on site patients and. and, 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 and so now I'm just listening to a therapist, a cloud therapist. You can do it in the comfort of your home. Definitely. I'm going to say that 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 I'm going to say that. Definitely, definitely. Dr. Shabalala, exciting things happening? Exciting, exciting things. Sure. Okay, so I'm Dr. Nkosinati Shabalala, okay? Formerly known as Dr. Shabalala, we're sex in the app. Yes. We're going to say that. I also have my own private practice, okay, where I'm basically a sexual health specialist and a family practitioner. So I look at both ends of the stick. 
I look at chronic diseases, I look at sexual health, okay? And um, I'm gonna be building, this is a bomb, I'm gonna be building the first men's clinic yes. under government in Durban. Ah, and I'll be building it at Avega, AKK, SHC. Mm. And I also have an opportunity coming up with U Pharmacetspa. Okay, so they want me to basically incorporate my own clinic underneath, you know, spa pharmacy. So there are things that are coming, there are things that are surfacing, but I'm all doing this for mm. the community. I'm all doing this for the public. So ah. that is the anchor of everything that I touch, helping people, that's all. And get about this list of being a pig. Get about being a pig. Get about being a pig. Get about uh, in your organs and in your social health. So make sure that you do take a listen to this and engage with these two people. Do share this with your friends. It's monthly is not and I'll try to be better than you. And you will definitely be healed by it. Uh, Dr. Kumete, thank you so much. For joining us. Appreciate it. Shabalala, uh, you are family. Thank you.